Uh, hi guys, welcome to Sea Life Sydney Aquarium. My name is Dakota. I'm one of the aquarists that get to look after some of the really cool animals uh, that we have here at the aquarium. And I'm also one of the aquarists that are lucky enough to work with our poisonous and venomous tank. So this is the bubble tank, obviously, as you can see. Um, and in here we do have both poisonous and venomous fish. One of the main uh, confusions between the two is that both poison and venom get misconstrued as the same thing. Um, when they are in fact different from each other. So venom and poison are not the same thing. Uh, both are a toxic substance uh, that can cause harm to the victim, but the main difference is the way that the substance is actually delivered. So poison is a toxic that gets uh, into the body via inhaling, absorbing through the skin or swallowing, whereas venom is a specialized type of poison that has evolved for specific uh, purposes. It is actively injected into a victim via bite or sting. So for example, as you can see, our lionfish in here, they are the red and white striped fish with the really pretty fins. Uh, so these guys, you can see all of those spikes on the dorsal side of their body, so their back, um, they actually have 13 venomous spines. Now you won't actually see the spines until they are actually in use and they do protrude through those fins and then they do inject um, the victim. Animals that are poisonous, so for example our porcupine fish that we have in here, you can see one of our three bars just here, our freckled and another three bar down the bottom. Uh, these guys won't actually attack their prey but rather release their toxins or poison as a result of being eaten, touched or even disturbed. So you can see um, our freckled porcupine just swimming up to the surface there. Uh, venomous animals are more active when it comes to defending themselves. So they tend to use a harpoon or syringe-like structure that does inject their victim. Um, but another really cool thing, we don't actually have one of these guys here, is that some animals can actually be venomous and poisonous. So an example of this is actually the blue ring octopus, which I'm sure a lot of people have heard of before. Um, so the blue ring octopus actually has a venomous beak, but if it is ingested, it is actually poisonous as well, which is quite cool. Um, but I hope I've told you a little bit about the difference between both poison and venom, um, and we hope to see you real soon here at Sea Life Sydney Aquarium.